They may have gotten away with it on several occasions in the past, but the law has finally got up with the two petroleum pipeline vandals. Now, the Federal High Court in Joss, Plato State, has sentenced them to 25 years imprisonment for their role in the crime. Justice Ambrose Alagoa, while delivering his judgment, sentenced them to five years jail term on each count of the five charges instituted by the Plato State Command of the Nigeria Security and Civil Defense Corps, NSCDC, while a third person pleaded not guilty. The suspects were arraigned before a federal high court in Jos on a five-count charge of unlawful obstruction of premium motor spirit, unlawful interference with free flow of premium motor spirit, unlawful dealing in premium motor spirits, unlawful procurement of premium motor spirits, as well as unlawful aid to procure premium motor spirits. Three suspects were apprehended by vigilantes in Taria Jingrim Basa local government area of Plateau State for vandalizing NMPC pipelines in the area. State Commandant Vincent Bature commends the efforts of the community leader and the vigilantes in apprehending the suspects before handing them over to the security agents. The mandate of this very, uh, given to us, this very year 2014, we are trying to put zero tolerance to vandalism in that area. Because what happened last year, we even got some people got burnt beyond recognition in that very spot that these people were arrested. Which means, uh, because since that very thing that happened last year around September, up to now we have not gotten any uh, activities of the vandals there. But now I think they are forgotten that they are resuming again. So we want some very serious warning that uh, we have strategized enough and we will really descend on all these vendors that are. They, they, they should better stop it. The further trial of the other suspect and the subsequent result of same is now in the eyes of the public.